Paige Swanky and welcome back to my channel. Today I have another fun review for you guys featuring the Jujubee Be Zealous in the new Galaxy print. You guys, this print is super pretty in person. I love it. It's really vibrant. As you can see, my particular print placement has a lot of the darker spaces to it, but I kind of like it because it really makes the lighter spaces pop. And it's just, it's a really pretty bag. I can see it being really fun to take to Disney and places like that. Now, Jujube did make a couple changes to this bag. And I know for sure that one of them is the very bottom of the bag, which was the main issue that I had with the previous Be Zealous was they had a thick piece of plastic in the very bottom and it kind of was really uncomfortable on your back. But this one, they replaced it with the foam and it is now very, very comfortable and I can't wait to get this bag of more prints now. But today I have it here in Galaxy and it is really pretty. So let's go ahead and get started. I have this bag packed up for me and my two and a half year old, he is currently potty training. He is not 100% there yet, but we are getting there. <laughs> so it does have things like training pants and a portable potty and things like that in here. So if you are potty training your child, this may be a helpful video for you. If not, you just wanna check out this video anyways, that's great too. <laughs> so let's go ahead and get started. So the first thing I wanna talk about is this adorable fob. So I decided to pair my Sailor Moon fob with the Galaxy print because it was just too perfect not to do that. And it just gives me a really good excuse to put Sailor Moon on my bag. <laughs> so I absolutely love this one. You guys can find this at Fobs by Andrea and I will link her information down below for you guys. So I'm going to go ahead and start with the outside pockets, like bottle pockets, top pockets, and things like that. And then we will jump onto the inside of the bag for the major packing portion of this video. One of the things I really like about the Be Zealous is that it is very much like the Be Right Back, but I actually like the way it packs more. There's times when I want to use the Be Right Back for like big trips and things like that because it's the way it opens. But this one, I really like that it has the gussets on the sides and it holds basically just as much as the Be Right Back, if not a little bit more. So here we go. I'm gonna start with the bottle pockets. These are not insulated as far as I can tell. They do have some nice thick padding in here, which makes it a great place for my phone. So I have my iPhone 8 Plus down in there and it fits great. It's actually just the perfect size and with that little padding in there, it makes it a really great place for your phone. And then you have one more bottle pocket on the other side. Great place for swell bottles, baby bottles, and things like that. I don't have anything in this pocket right now though. I was actually able to fit everything I needed inside the bag itself. So that was great. Now let's go through the top pocket on this bag. So the very top pocket here, this is very much like the Be Right Back where you have a secret pocket on the top here. So you have one zipper pull and it is a large felt lined pocket. This pocket is big enough to fit my camera in, the one I am filming with, which is great. Or you can put smaller cameras in here. You can also put your phone in here if you want to. But I just like to keep things, right now it's very cold out, so I have my hat down in here and I could also fit my gloves down in there. So that is great for winter time. But it's a pretty spacious pocket, you guys. Look how far down it goes. I love it. So that is the felt lined pocket on this bag. Let's go ahead and go through the front pockets here. So on this very front pocket here, you have two zipper pulls. And if you guys can't already tell, there's these adorable little Saturn planet zipper pulls. And I think that's just so cute with this print. And I love how Jujube has been changing up the zipper pulls to go along with the actual print design. So that's really neat. So this opens on both sides like this. You can easily access all of your things on the inside. So in here, you have a zipper pocket along the back here. You have your key fob here. You also have two gusseted pockets here. So I have my son's iPod. This just has educational games and things on it so he can play while we're out and about if he's bored. And in this pocket here, I have a small set piece. I have probably the worst print placement you could get on a small set piece, which is kind of funny. And you guys know how I am about my small set pieces, but I thought it was kind of funny. So here we go. I've got chapstick, lotion, a folding hairbrush down in there, a mirror, and a hair tie. It's just some things for myself that I like to keep in the front area so I can easily access them. So besides that, you also have a little bit of space in the very front here, which is a good place for your wallet. If you have a nice slim but long wallet, that would fit in there great. So that is the very front pocket, also known as the mommy pocket. And I really like it on this bag. I love how spacious it is. And then you also have one zipper pocket down in front here. I don't have anything in there right now, but that is what it looks like. And it kind of goes up in the front here and down in the bottom. So it's just, this bag has so much space and so many places to put things. 
I just love that. So now that we've gone through the outside pockets and things, I did want to also go over the back of the bag while we are here. But you can see the print a little bit better on the back. You have a lot of really, really pretty colors. You have the purples, blues, there's um, a very pale lavender, and then you have the really, really dark purple here. So it's a very vibrant bag, and my kids, I was taking them to school this morning, and they were like, Mom, your new bag is so cool. It's so bright and pretty. I'm like, wow, my kids like this bag. So I was really surprised that they were into it. But um, yeah, and you guys know I have all boys, so it's just a really pretty print. But I also really love the grab handle on top here. It has some webbing here, strap webbing, and then you have a slightly padded grab handle. So for me with backpacks, grab handle is a must have. It just makes it a lot easier to grab and go out of the car and it saves your straps wear and tear from pulling it out like this. But I do like the padded straps on here. It is a thicker foam with a seam down the middle and then you have a very adjustable strap. So you guys can see I actually have a lot of slack because I'm only five foot two, so um, I do have to worry about having a little bit of extra slack. I'm trying to think of what I can do, maybe loop it through here or something to make it not as long. I'm trying to think of ideas. Maybe you guys can put that in the comments below, give me ideas. <laughs> I know maybe I can even use like some uh, rubber bands or something to tie them up a little bit. So anyways, let's go ahead and jump onto the inside of the bag. So let's go ahead and get inside this bag. These zippers do go all the way down on both sides of the bag, but you can choose to stop them about halfway so you can access things on top. So that's what I'm going to do first before I open it all the way up. So I did mention I have this bag packed for potty training for my two and a half year old. So the first thing I have on top here is this bag here, and this has a portable potty in it which is really awesome. I've used it with my last two kids. I may have even used it with my first child. I can't remember, but this thing is awesome. I got it on Amazon. I will make sure to link this down below for you guys as well. And also, if you are in the process of potty training your child, I will link a video right here for you guys that I made for when I potty trained my second son. And I used that video to help me get through this time around too. And that it was so helpful, you guys, to be able to refer back to that. So if you need some tips and tricks, definitely go check out my video for potty training. But this is the potty. It is squishy and soft, but you can just unfold it, stick it on top of a big potty out in public, and then your child can sit on that and feel just a little bit more comfortable. So this has been great and it's very sturdy, but it's also super compact and I love it. And it comes with this little um, travel case too, so you don't have to let the rest of your bag touch all the nasty stuff. <laughs> so that was on very top. Right in front of that, I have my Be Quick here in Space Place. What better print to go with Galaxy than Space Place, you guys? I am so happy that I still keep some of this stuff around from so long ago because this just looks so cute with Galaxy. So in here, I just have some potty training necessities. I put it on top because if my son had an accident, I really wanted to be able to access everything very quickly. So I have a couple of training pants down in here and I also have a wet bag. So my wet bag is actually the space. I think it's called Toki Space. It's very much like Space Place, but it's by Kanga Care. It's a very large size wet bag, can fit clothes in here, cloth diapers, um, all that kind of stuff. But I just, I love their wet bags. They're so nice. So that was in there. I also have two training pants in here by Kanga Care as well. And if you guys wanna shop these, I do have a link with them and I will leave that down below for you guys as well. But these are my go-to for potty training. They are amazing. I love them. And this is just a really cute print, but this uh, I think was Toki Joy or something like that from back in the day. Um, but you, I mean, you can use them over and over again. That's the great thing about them and they're machine washable. So you can't beat that. And then I have one more here. Super cute. So those have been so helpful. And then I also have a little baggy dispenser just in case um, some of my wipes. I do like to use wipes instead of toilet paper while I'm out and about. And you don't wanna put poopy wipes into a trash can. That's not nice. <laughs> so if you have a little bag, that works a little bit better. So that was in my Be Quick. And so this is how I have the rest of it packed up. I have a lot of Galaxy goodies down in here. So I think for the rest of this, I'm probably going to unzip it all the way down, just so you guys can see a little bit better. 
I love the way this packs. So you have two mesh pockets on the very front here. They're good size. You could definitely fit a medium set piece in one of these if you wanted to. So on the left here, I have my wallet. This is a Kate Spade Kara wallet. It's fairly thick, but it fits great in that pocket there. Next to that, on this side, I have a couple things. I have a thing of mini M&Ms. This has been my go-to bribery trick for potty training. So anytime my son is out and about in public and we hit a toilet, then he gets a special treat after he does it and it just helps reinforce the potty training methods. <laughs> so this has been a lifesaver. And then I also have some working hands cream. It has been wonderful on my eczema this winter. And then I also have a little pair of gloves for him because it's been so cold. So those are the things I had in the very front pocket here. On the left here, I have a large set piece in the galaxy print. So pretty. And so in here, I have a change of clothes for my son just in case. You can never be too prepared when you're potty training. So I have a pair of socks, pants, and a long sleeve top in there. Next to that, I have my Be Cool, which I think fits so great in all these bags, you guys. I think I like it more than the fuel cell just because of the structure and the shape. Um, it just makes things a lot easier to go through. So there you go. That's what it looks like. And if you guys want to see a full review on this bag, I will link that video right here for you as well. So this has a double zipper opening, but because of where I have this on this side, I wanted to be able to just pull this down and get into it real quick if I needed to. So that's just a little zipper trick for when you have things packed in your bags. Make it so that the zipper pulls are accessible to you. <laughs> so this is what I have in here, just some snacks. And I also have a spell bottle here. This is my traveler mug. And I just thought this color was so pretty with this print, but this has water. And then I also have lots of snacks for my son, but I also have some almonds for me crackers for my son, an apple juice, a little travel milk, granola bar, and some fruit snacks because if I'm out for a while, then he does literally go through all these. He is a big time snacker. So that's all I had in there. Move some of this stuff out of the way. So this is how it looks on the inside now. It's almost empty. You do have a change pad back here. This is a light change pad. And I feel like for the size of the backpack, they probably should have used a memory foam change pad, but I'm thankful that there's still one in here just in case you need it. So, and this one is great because you can actually collapse it and fold it and put it into a be quick if you wanted to. So. I like that about it, but I do miss having the memory foam ones. So that was in the very back elastic pocket, which also would function well for school. You guys could totally put a laptop back in there, folders, all that stuff. And then you have a strapped pocket up here. This is the pocket from the very top of the bag with the felt. So if you fill it up inside this pocket here, then it bulks this up a little bit, but this is a great place to put a blanket rolled up or you could put a nursing cover in here, or you could put some wipes. So that's a, such a great little pocket, I love that one. And then in the very back here, I only have one more thing, and that is my wipes. With potty training, it's good to have these on hand and not just tucked away in a pouch or something. So having these available is great. So I have the wipe pouch here in the Mufia print. So. Anyways, that is my packing video, you guys. I hope you loved it. Packing this way has been great for potty training, so. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and found it helpful, and if you did, please give it a big thumbs up and definitely subscribe while you're here if you're new. Keep an eye out soon on my channel later this week for more fun GGB videos. Thanks for watching. Mm -hmm.